I often get asked, is GitHub my CV? And people's reactions or expression when they say that is two things. If you want to learn more about the open source community, consider subscribing. My name is Eddie. I'm really passionate about open source and about getting you into open source. Last year, I was in the top 500 open source contributors in the world on GitHub, and there are about 16 million people. I've trended in the top 11 people on GitHub with the likes of Facebook, Twitter, and various other. One, they're hoping for a yes, and that's because they do a lot of open source work, and they give a lot back to the community, and all their learnings and their practices are on GitHub. And two, they're hoping that I say no, because they haven't done that, and they believe in the old fashioned way of doing a CV or your LinkedIn profile. So I'm gonna be honest. Yes, it does matter. I really and strongly and wholeheartedly believe it does matter because anyone can write anything on their CV and their LinkedIn and more, some people are more honest than others and some people exaggerate the truth and some people just lie. And that always comes out in the wash, but why go through all that pain of hiring someone or working with someone and then finding out it wasn't what you were expecting? If it was your money and you were hiring someone as a web developer or as a gardener, for example, would you rather hear it from them that they're amazing, they do awesome stuff and they'll give you exactly what you want or would you rather see photos of the work that they've done and the journey they've been on and they say here's the before, here's the garden before we landscaped it, here's the process of us landscaping it and here's the final product. You're more likely to trust that person and you can see their work and their journey. The same goes for GitHub. People want to see your journey, so don't worry about making it absolutely perfect. And even if you did put perfect code out there today, if you're learning, then the code in four weeks, you won't like it and it won't be perfect, and that's fine. So just keep putting it out on GitHub and that will be your CV. So I'm sorry if it upsets you that uh, I really believe that GitHub is your CV. Uh, open source work, whatever you do, your learnings and your, and your playings or with code and tools. Uh, but that's, that's the truth. If I get a stack of CVs, this might, this might be controversial, but if I get a stack of CVs, I always want the ones with GitHub accounts on the top. So I'm going to look at those first. I'm going to get the CV, I'm going to go to their GitHub account and I'm going to bin the CV. I want to see how people, how they work and how they collaborate. Do they document their work? Do they write automated tests? Um, in their own environment, not other than being forced to write the automated tests. Do they want to? Do they understand the benefits? So when push comes to shove, will they have the documentation there? Will they have the automated tests there? And will they want a quality piece of work or rather rush it through and get onto the next story just to please people, where in the longer term that won't please anybody and just creates a lot of tech debt? I think it's really important to see how people collaborate on GitHub when they write issues, when they create pull requests, and they reply to pull requests and reply to issues. Do they give constructive uh, criticism in a, in a nice and friendly uh, way and an inclusive way, or do they discriminate? It's just really important to see how people react with people they've never met before and probably will never meet. If it was your money, your hard-earned money that you work day and night and week after week and month after month to save and you were going to pay someone to do a web dev job or to do a landscaping job, what would you want? Would you want to see their work or would you trust them on their word? I think enough said. So what makes you an exception? Is it because you'll tell the truth? But people don't know you that you would tell the truth and I'm sure you would tell the truth. But there are so many people who don't tell the truth and that unfortunately uh, makes it bad for the rest of us. What's the conclusion? Get coding open source on GitHub today. Even if it's you playing with a new tool or a new library, or a new framework, just put your playings and your findings out there on GitHub and that's all still really good and acceptable and adds to your portfolio. I know Microsoft bought GitHub, but that's a discussion for another time. Do you think your open source GitHub should be your CV? Why don't you comment below and let me know your thoughts.